Hmm. Okay, let's see what this place is about. Looks like we have Ice Physics the boss making its unwanted return. Okay, what's down here? Death? Yes. Okay, <laughs> that was a stupid question. Anyhow. You know how that cryptic bullshit loves to creep its ugly head? Am I right, folks? Ooh. I see what's going on here. I'm pretty sure these are the same species of enemies that we've seen in, like, uh... Super Mario 64 and, uh... That... Oh, crap. I am in a bad spot. Of course I am. I was pretty much screwed no matter what. <laughs> God damn it. I hate that. Another thing I hate is ice physics no matter what game you play. Ice physics always are bad. I mean, it can be fun sometimes to skate on ice like you're like a figure skater, but... Ugh, crap. Wasted. Wasted a bunch of shots unnecessarily. And I killed myself again because of ice. God damn it. All right, I'll be right back again. Okay, finally back again. Thankfully, it didn't take me too long to do that. Even so, though, that was really, really annoying. Oh, no, 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 no. Oh, can't afford to get squished here. <laughs> I bet you if I get squished, then it's a one-hit kill. Then again, maybe it'll just deal damage instead. Hmm. Oh, okay. Oh, no, 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 no. Oh, my God. Wow, I'm surprised that even worked. Oh no, you are not going, you're not getting away from me. Not, not that easily. Ooh. Oh, this is going to be fun. <laughs> How appropriate. Okay, there we go. That wasn't too bad. Oh, <laughs> I see what we got here. If this isn't a one-hit kill, I don't know what is. Either way, I'm not planning to find out anytime soon. <laughs> hell no. Oh, hell no. <laughs> uh, just saying. Oh, dear. Surprised that even worked. Whatever, I need to restore my beads anyway. Also, I see you there. Okay, how am I supposed to get up there then? Uh, game? What are you not telling me? Oh. <laughs> hmm. Just had to make a shitty guess. <laughs> Cryptic bullshit is bullshit. It always is, always will be. No, 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 no. Okay. Fire. Excellent. Perfect timing for that. What's well, not so perfect timing though? Hmm. Running out of yarn balls and then uh, having to be forced to go through a gauntlet. Go through a gauntlet of deadly blocks. God damn it. Okay, they are one hit kills.
Alrighty, I'm back. And I'm out of freaking yarn balls again. God damn it. Alright, we're doing this the old fashioned way. That works. That totally works. Oh, crap. Oh, this is gonna be the frickin' pits. Oh, man. How are we gonna get this one? Perhaps I just screwed myself over because I need the extra height. Or I can just do that. That works, too. Whew, that was hairy. <laughs> What can I say about this place? It's Harry the freaking Fortress. <laughs> hmm. Okay, up we go. Right there, perfect. <laughs> I'm surprised that didn't freeze me completely. Usually, that is what happens. But no. Game was actually nice enough to not kill me. But it's gonna kill me again now, of course. Yes. Okay, up we go. Whew, that was close. Oh shit! Okay. That was bullshit, man. Okay, got it. There we go. Perfect. Uh, okay, what am I missing? Three stamps, of course. Well, screw it. Let's just go fight the boss. <laughs> I can go search for them uh, on my next trip. getting on my nerves <laughs> hey you in the parka send this Yoshi back to the Ice Age <laughs> not sure why I hesitated to read that there but eh, whatever oh my another giant fight what else is new okay I see what we gotta do here Although, having a full uh, arsenal of eggs right now would be helpful. By eggs, I mean yarn balls. Oh my god, I did it again. How did that not count as a hit? I don't know. This game sometimes can be quite finicky. Okay, this fight doesn't take a genius to figure out how to defeat him, or at the very least damage him. Just gotta wait for him to get to the right orientation. Then hit him a few times. I think having uh, larger yarn balls will uh, make it so you only need to use two balls instead of three. <laughs> That's my guess. I mean, this is just a pure guess of mine. I'm just pulling out my frickin' butthole. I can't say if big yarn balls will be the most useful thing for this fight. I'm gonna say yes because of their versatility. But that's just a guess. Hmm. 
Okay, that's one strategy that you can use. During the first part of the fight, just wait until he spits out six Shy Guys and then use that to your advantage. <laughs> that way you can deal two quick successive hits, like, almost instantly. But hey. Wait, why did I say that? I don't know. <laughs> okay, what do you have up, up your freaking arsenal next? God, I hit so many freaking buttons. God damn it. Hmm, one other thing worth noting too is that ice physics will work against you throughout this fight too. And you're done. <laughs> that was sweet. <laughs> Not exactly the most spectacular way to fight the guy and really it was the most inefficient way possible. But hey, what can you do? Just gotta learn the guy's patterns and work with it. Slowly yet surely. Okay. Now that that's done, it's time to... <laughs> it's time to continue... Or... No, not continue. What am I saying? I'm not sure anymore. Oh, new badge! This is probably the Ice Melon All You Can Eat Ice Melon badge. Judging by the look of the badge itself. And the Yoshi we've rescued this time is... Sniffberg the Yoshi. <laughs> I like it. I like that name very, very much. And since we've collected all the smiley flowers, 5S is now officially opened. However, that's not the only thing that's opened. Hmm, Kamek is pissed. <laughs> and honestly, I don't blame him at this point. Oh my! Wow! Okay, World 6 has officially opened up. And it looks like one spectacular castle. Probably filled with eight levels or nine levels if you want to get technical. If you know what I mean. Ah, uh, shoot. That was not the right choice of words. Either way, it's time for me to go hunting for some stamps and to maximize my health and go flawless in the boss fight. Anyhow, I'll see you all soon when I find the stamps and, uh, yeah, I'll see you all when I find the stamps. And yeah, just as I thought, all you could eat ice melons. Okay, let's go. Okay, that's interesting. Here we go. And there's the last stamp. And with that, the level is now 100% complete. Finally. Took a while, but whatever. The deed is finally done. Let's finish up this recording session with Yoshi's Curtain Call. 5S. <laughs> okay. Uh, I'm going to say this. This is going to be the badge that I'm going to use. And just like all the rest of the special levels, this one will have no check points, most likely. <laughs> all right. Let's see what we can do. Oh, I think I see what this uh, level's gimmick is. 
gonna be riding on curtains. And we're gonna do it really, really quickly. So screw that badge. I'm gonna go ahead and grab a, um, no, 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 uh, this one. This is the one I want. That'll make things exponentially easier. That way I can just attract everything to me. That way I don't have to worry about being precise. <laughs> However, timing is still key. Oh, oh man, I am loving this level so far. Woo! Man, these curtains are fast. Fast as freaking lightning. Oh no, crap, I missed something. <laughs> Dang it. All right, I'll be right back. There we go. Whoa, <laughs> that was close. Oh man, I missed something, I think. <laughs> missed a strand of beads, which isn't good. Did I collect everything? I missed a flower, but I did get everything else. <laughs> Well, that's unfortunate. Dang it. Oh, well. It's all right. <laughs> that was still a very fun level, though. Short, but fun as all hell. <laughs> okay, let's see what bonus game we have. Mm -hmm. Yeah. It's unfortunate that we missed a flower. It's the very last one, too. <laughs> Plus, we still need to maximize my health. And the question remains, how do I do that? There aren't any hidden clouds as far as I can see, and there are no checkpoints either to speak of. Oh man, I missed the melon. I should have grabbed it earlier when I had the chance. Oh well. Well, at least I got a good chunk of uh, my beads back from that previous run. Even so, though, it sucks that I couldn't get everything on my first go. <laughs> oh, yeah. Definitely need that attracting badge. That is, like, the best badge to have for the level because of the fact that you're sliding on the curtain at the speed of sound. <laughs> okay, the Yoshi we've managed to rescue this time is... Super NES Yoshi! And he's based on the North American SNES too. I bet you on the European version, he's based on the European uh, Super Famicom. However, that's just a guess. Okay, time to go hunting that last flower. And also uh, max my health somehow. Alright, see y'all soon. <laughs> Oh, I get it. I get it now. That's a one-shot. It is a one-shot opportunity. Dang it. Well, at least we got another bonus game. Go. 
got it. Oh, and another bonus game. I'm cool with that. And with that, this level, or more or less this entire world, World 5, is now finally 100% completed. So with that, we've 100% all five of the main worlds, well, all five of the initial worlds, but of course we are getting ready to start World 6, but not in this recording session. It's getting late and I need to eat dinner. And with that, I'm going to go ahead and close this recording session out. This is General Snivy with Let's Play Yoshi's Wooly World Blind. Thank you all so much for watching, and if you enjoyed this video, please remember to leave a like. Next time, we're diving into the very last world of the game, World 6, which looks like we're heading into Bowser's Castle. <laughs> oh boy, sounds like fun, eh folks? <laughs> oh, believe me, the fun has only just begun. So once again, thank you all so much for watching. Hope you all enjoyed and I will see you all next time.